Welcome to the Stealth AI Starter Pack, the latest Unreal Engine Marketplace release from Copper Gaming, which, if you don't know, is the game studio that I am a part of. So as I say, this is the Stealth AI Starter Pack, and this gives you access to dynamic, fully customizable, and easy to use AI systems such as patrol, sight and audio detection, chase with music, and much, much more, as well as implementing easy blueprint systems for you to use in your game. So this will allow you to set up multiple AI in your level at the click of a button that the player will then have to stealthily manoeuvre around. These AI are easily customizable, either globally in the blueprint or individually in the level. So there are three main different types of AI in this pack. If I were to select an AI in the level here, we can see in the bottom right down here we have the AI type. So we have search, patrol and guard. Now the patrol AI is all done through one blueprint, so you can place this in your level, assign it to a value and then create your own patrol path for it. You can then assign as many AI as you want to patrol this path. Using just this one blueprint, you can create as many patrol paths as you want in your game. The AI will then stick to this patrol path until they detect the player and upon this they will then chase the player and then return to the next patrol point once the chase has ended. Next, the guard AI can be set up to guard the location that the AI spawns in or walk to a set location in the level to guard there instead. And similarly to the patrol AI, the guard will stay in this space until they detect the player and then chase them and once the chase ends they will then return back to their guard spot. And finally, the search AI will just randomly search a defined area to look for the player. So it will be a random roam until finding the player. Upon finding them, they will chase, and when the chase ends, they will go back to just randomly searching the area once again. Now, I've mentioned that the AI will find the player, but how do they do that? Well, that is through both sight and noise detection. So all AI are equipped with vision to be able to detect and chase the player. And these sight detection settings can be modified to your desires. On top of this, there is also noise detection, so all the AI also contain the ability to hear noises that you can define. This means that the player can distract the AI or be caught by making too much noise. So upon hearing a noise, the AI will go to the area the noise came from to investigate and then chase the player if they are seen. So in terms of the stealth pack that this is in, this could be great for distracting the AI as I say, so you could throw a rock in a certain area, the AI will move over there and the player can then sneak around to get into the castle, for example, or if they are running about, the AI might hear that and then go investigate and find them as the player has made too much noise. Upon detecting and finding the player, they will chase as I've said, and this chase will continue until they either catch the player or lose sight of them. So upon losing the player, the AI will then continue searching for a defined time before returning to what they are doing before chasing. So, for example, if the AI are chasing the player and the player goes around the corner, the AI has now lost the player, however they will continue going towards the player for a set hey. amount of time before giving up and ending the chase, as obviously the AI should know that the player has gone around that corner. So you can customise how long the AI will continue hey. chasing before giving up the chase once they've lost detection of the player. And as I've said before, they will go back to doing hey. what they were doing before the hey. chase once it has ended. For example, a patrol AI will go back to its patrol path and resume where it left off, the guard AI will return back to its guard post, and the search AI will continue searching the area randomly. And when a chase is initiated, hey. chase music will start and continue playing until the final AI has stopped chasing the player. Another feature that is included in this pack is a detection meter and bar. So when the AI first sees the player, a sound effect will play and a detection meter bar will pop up above that hey. AI's head, indicating uh -huh. that that specific AI has seen the player hey. and if they are still currently detecting the player. Once this bar fills up, another sound effect will play and the bar will change colour before then initiating a chase with the chase music. If the player is already being chased, hey, the AI uh -huh. will join in instead of starting a new chase. And this detection meter can be toggled hey. on and off as not everybody hey. will want it. However, toggling it off means the AI will then give chase immediately upon seeing the player instead of noticing them, hey. waiting a few seconds, 
while they're still seeing them and continuing the chase. Hey. So a good way to think of this huh? is a Far Cry hey. or Hitman kind of detection system. As well as all of this, all the AI use behavior trees and blackboards and a setup so that you can easily add on to the current existing structure or remove and change anything you don't like. An example map is also included to test out the different AI in action and that is the map you've been seeing in this video. On top of this, there are also 10 whistle sound effects included so that the player can distract and taunt the enemies in proximity to the player as well as chase music being included too. So some of the technical details of this are that it features fully customizable and easy to set up systems, a dynamic patrol path blueprint which allows you to easily create multiple paths using just one blueprint so it's very very easy to use, a patrol AI that will follow a set path and return to the next point after they finish chasing the player, a search AI that will randomly search a set area, a guard AI that can be guarding the location they are spawned in or a set location in the map that they will then go to. There is sight detection, noise detection and a chase system with music. As well as this, the way it's made is with no hard casting, so the AI will detect and chase any player, not just a specific one. This system is a plug and play straight out of the box asset pack so you can use it immediately which is really good if you want to just start prototyping or use it this straight away. It also uses blueprint interfaces and game instances for efficiency and on top of that it also uses blackboards and behavior trees. One example demo map is included with 15 blueprints and 28 sound effects with those being 10 whistles, 14 spotted, 3 detected and 1 music. In total, there are 15 blueprints with the input being keyboard and mouse, and this is not network replicated, and documentation will be coming very soon, along with tutorials which I'll be making on how to use this as well. At the moment, this is supported on 5.0 all the way up to 5.3, and the price is $15. This is also a pack that we will continue updating throughout the future as well, so if you think there are any things which is missing from this which you think could improve this, definitely do let me know in the comments down below and we will look into adding that in as well. But I hope you've enjoyed this video on me showcasing the Stealth AI Starter Pack which is something which I have made and I'm selling through my game studio Copper Gaming. So of course there is a link in the description down below and in the pinned comment where you can buy this on the Unreal Engine Marketplace and I hope you do enjoy it. If you do buy it and you do enjoy it please do leave a positive review and a positive rating as it really does help us out a lot on the marketplace algorithm and it would really just help us all out. So thank you very much and I hope you enjoy the Stealth AI starter pack on the Unreal Engine marketplace.